Mercedes-Benz S-Class. Instead of using the already established litter sensors as the guidance system, the new Mercedes-Benz S-Class comes equipped with Bosch's advanced video cameras to create the automated valet parking feature. The first demonstration of the technology was performed at Stuttgart Airport P6, in which a flagship S-Class showcased how its self-parking feature worked. To facilitate the demonstration, the P6 parking garage set up a spacious drop-off and pickup area where a driver could get out of the vehicle and initiate the self-parking function via smartphone. Being an S-Class, it does not only self-park, but also confirms if you've taken out all your important belongings beforehand. Once you've started the process, the vehicle activates sensors and cameras to detect and avoid obstacles along the way to the parking spot. And much like a GPS system, the estimated time of arrival is displayed on your phone screen too. Information from the infrastructure is used as part of the guidance system. BMW 7 Series Among the range of futuristic technologies on the new BMW 7 Series is the Park Assistant Plus, which allows the driver to remotely control the car from outside the vehicle itself using the key fob. The feature comes standard in the 7 Series. Parking Assistant Plus works in both perpendicular and parallel parking situations. Ultrasonic sensors mounted on the vehicle will detect a suitable parking spot although it has to drive past the spot in order to identify the space. With a press and hold of a button, the new 7 Series will take over the steering, transmission, accelerator, and brakes to autonomously park. Reversing assistant and remote control parking also come along. The former assumes the steering control and essentially mirrors the most recent forward movement, whereas the latter allows the driver to operate the automatic parking also using a key fob to get the car out of a tight space. Audi Q7 In a multi-story parking garage near the terminal of Hamburg Airport, an Audi is shown to drive itself to a predetermined spot as instructed by the driver via a smartphone. In that spot, a dry cleaning service employee hangs laundered clothes in the vehicle, which is then summoned back by the driver. The whole stunt is a demonstration of how the autonomous parking technology in the Audi Q6 should work. Payment also is done via the app without queuing at the parking machine. The technology exhibited in this demonstration has now left the research lab and is currently at further stages of development. Some initial vehicles from Volkswagen Group, which include Audi and Porsche among others, will come equipped with the feature. Volkswagen has said that its autonomous parking will roll out in stages. First, it'd only work in selected multi-story car parks, followed by implementation in exclusive traffic flow where parking areas are inaccessible to people. And finally, in mixed traffic situations or the typical public parking area, such as supermarkets. Ford Escape In August 2020, Ford announced a collaboration with Bosch and real estate developer Bedrock for a demonstration of the automaker's automated valet parking technology. The system utilizes Wi-Fi functionality on the previous Ford Escape, so the new improved feature should be quite promising indeed. The whole self-parking system is straightforward too. Driver takes the car to a designated drop-off zone, gets out of the vehicle, then uses a smartphone to start the process. Ford Escape will take over the steering, braking, transmission, and acceleration so that it can park in the intended spot. It'll even shut off automatically too. In case the vehicle detects obstacles, it stops to prevent a collision. To get out of the parking spot, the driver can summon the car back to the designated pickup area. During the demonstration, the car indeed stopped when a person walked in front of it, 
without any input from the driver. Bosch installed some litter towers at strategic places in the demonstration ground. These towers communicate with servers via Wi-Fi router in the garage. Tesla Model S Thanks to Tesla, electric cars have now become mainstream and desirable. However, the company is persistent not only in terms of its environmentally friendly approach to road transportation, but artificial intelligence in driving with autopilot mode in their cars. When it comes to self-parking technology, Tesla Model S is perhaps the most straightforward in the industry. First, the vehicle has to drive past the available parking spots, both perpendicular and parallel, then it displays those exact spots on the huge infotainment screen. The driver, who at this point remains inside, selects the desired parking space. Once the spot is selected, driver pushes a touchscreen button to let the car take over. It handles the steering, acceleration, and braking to do the autopilot function. When there's not enough clearance due to obstacles, the car will make the necessary adjustments. It can even apply handbrake at the end. Volkswagen Touareg Hybrid As it turns out, one of the first vehicles to receive the autonomous parking technology as demonstrated by the Audi Q6 is the latest Volkswagen Touareg. Volkswagen uses the technology as the baseline for the new self-parking feature. Normally, the driver has to activate the function using the vehicle's built-in infotainment system, then the car will commence the automated steering mechanism. But now with the latest Touareg Hybrid, the driver can get out of the vehicle before parking, take the key, and start the automation via smartphone. The car can also exit a tight parking space on its own without the driver getting in first. Porsche Cayenne Turbo SE Hybrid Using a compatible smartphone, you can control the self-parking feature on the new Porsche Cayenne Turbo S, including the e-hybrid variant. Similar to the technology used by BMW, the driver can get out of the car before parking and send a command from a remote control. However, instead of using a key fob, Porsche owners can initiate the process via smartphone. The system actually starts working when the driver is still inside the vehicle. Using the parking spot search function, the car looks for and indicates available parking spots whether on the side of the street, perpendicular spots, or parallel ones. When it arrives, the driver will get out and let the vehicle analyze the space thanks to sensors and surround view cameras. There are 12 ultrasonic sensors and four cameras to create a 360-degree view of the car's surrounding area. They also detect pedestrians and any other obstacles along its path to parking. It'll stop, then make automatic adjustments to compensate for obstructions. If need be, driver can pause the parking process via smartphone in case of incoming calls or notifications. Hyundai Tucson The autonomous parking technology available on the Hyundai Tucson is known as Remote Smart Park Assist. Thanks to a series of ultrasonic sensors mounted on the vehicle, the system can help avoid collision by applying emergency brake the moment it detects obstacles. In the video demonstration, it does not seem that Hyundai's Tucson is actually self-parking. The driver can get out of the car before parking indeed but still the vehicle requires constant input from a remote control or smart key. The SUV is shown to only be able to move forward and backward without making any turn at all. It might not be the best today, but it can be useful to help the driver get the car in and out of a tight parking spot, including small garages without being inside the vehicle. <laughs>